Hello and welcome people. Tonight we are playing Call It My Creator Rally. And well, let's go into career. And lobster load. Alright, it's all from the start. And we're gonna give it our best, okay? We gotta give it our best. Shield VW Polo. Okay. Manual, of course, manual. Alright, we're in Germany. Let's let's think it through. Let's play a bit more seriously than we have been playing. Alright, uh, info, car setup, info. Land section, gravel, tom, smooth tarmac, light gravel, smooth tarmac, smooth tarmac. Overall, alright. Alright, car setup, tire, smooth tarmac. I'm gonna go for abrasive tarmac so that it gives a nice compromise. Low, as low as it can be, soft, as soft as it can be, soft. Alright, steering, gearbox. I'm gonna go with slightly higher gears. So I don't have to, so I can really get the best out of this engine. And let's race. All right, let's race. Let, let, let's remember. Now I'm racing still without pace note. All right. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Okay. All right. You, when the gears are this long, you really get to see where the power band is. Ah, ooh, nice safe. All right, all right, let's continue. I right, drop a gear, drop a gear. There we go. One up. I'm used to this section with shorter gears, so that's why my shifting is a bit up right now. But oh, well, we're getting good frame rates. Ow. Ow. All right, all right. Back to first, back to first. Alright, we didn't damage anything. Well, anything important, that is. Alright, back to tarmac. Oh, is this tarmac? Yeah, it's tarmac. Alright. Uh, part one of the stage is complete, and I almost ran into that. And I almost ran, I actually ran into that, and I'm eating bread for some reason. I, I, I hate when the game does that, like, alright, I screwed up, you don't have to rub it in my face, game. Aside from that, I really, really like this game. Alright. Alright, alright, there's a sharp left coming. So let's cut it. And even with me cutting the left turn, ugh, the gearing, the gearing is what I gotta jut down the most because if I had a, like a gear shifter, I could get the gears right because I know how to drive a manual. But with this, it's more akin to a sequential gearbox than a manual. It's actually a sequential here because you don't operate the clutch, so you can't use the clutch, for example, like clutch kicks or stuff. And well, in front wheel drive clutch kicks aren't that... Clutch kicks are not uh, all the rage. They, they do have a function. And if you're on a hill climb and you need extra power and your engine is really, really revvy and, and the power's all at the top, you can use a clutch kick at the expense of your clutch heating up to get more power down because the engine hasn't been able to get up there so we're going slow here because I don't have the I'm not used to the gearing that is necessary oh down to first down to first no oh, back to first I said first no not reverse first okay that wasn't so bad it's not my worst pass through there Also, I'm really used to short shifting cars because, you know, fuel economy, you're, you're used to... I learned to hypermile without even knowing I was hypermiling. And then I realized, wait a minute, I, I drive like a bloody hypermiler. And I don't know why, and it's because, well, when I learned to drive, my parents were really stingy, so they didn't want to waste gasoline. And that's a fact of life. So stingy parents make you a good hypermiler. They also make you really a line-focused driver, like you're better 
without people around you than you are in a race. Like you're better for time attack than for racing. If you get used to hyper hypermiling. All right, stage is complete. 344. Right, we are in 14th place. No points awarded. But hey, at least we're not the last ones. Alright, so we're in 6th place. Let's continue. Australia. Alright, car repair. Really quickly. What's the most important? Cooling, that's important. Body work, that's important. Hey. Gearbox, engine. Alright, what did I leave? Axles and suspension. Yeah, that's, that will be repaired later. Alright, info. Let's check it. Alright, pea gravel, pea gravel, pea gravel. Alright. Basically, we're gonna go to car setup, peak gravel, and leave. All right, I'm gonna. May, should I shorten the gears a bit? No, no, I'm gonna leave them there. I'm just gonna race with those gears unless there's a super hairpin ridden track. All right, all right, let's let's go. Two. One, go. Do you come from the land down under? When men live and men plunder. Oh, wait, I already did that joke twice. Damn. It is getting old. That's why we gotta win this championship to advance career mode and stop with the bad jokes. Alright. Alright. Ouch. Alright, sharp left, sharp left. Into third, second, third. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I really hope the audio quality of this video is a lot better. Woohoo! Jump, 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 jump. All right, fifth gear, fifth gear like that show that got canceled. Ooh, fifth gear got canceled. Did you hear about that, guys? People, fifth gear got fucking canceled, and I don't know why. Ooh, there was a lag spike there. I hope it's fixed. Ah, oh, it wasn't. And just in time for the jump! Oh, that was awesome. I like jumps. They're bad for the car, but they're good for the camera. And lag spike. Alright, let's see. No, the game won't rescue me. So, apparently, this is just... Lag spike. Lag spike. Alright. Damn it. The lag is killing me. Another lag spike. What the hell? Oh, maybe the, my computer is thermal throttling. Because I, my uh, PC fan broke. Not the one in the laptop. Not the one that's included inside the laptop. But an external one that I had rigged with a power supply. That one broke. One of the fins broke. And then the whole fan just kind of... Alright. Just... Me. How the hell am I supposed to get out of here? Oh, like that. Okay, that wasn't so hard. Alright. So basically, this... This stage is screwed. I'm only gonna retry it, because that's... Well, against my moral code. Oh, that was nice. I feel like wall tapping... Is can be productive if you know how to do it. Like tapping walls can get you better times if you know how to do it right. Like in a corner or some or something like that to correct your line. But you need the walls to be in the right place and you need to tap them in the right place and at the right time. So it's sometimes it's more of a gamble than a technique. And I just killed everyone. I'm a Mustang now. Oh, it skipped a gear. Transmissions acting. Up. Maybe it's the axle shaft that is acting up weirdly. All right, fight the inside to combat understeer. What the hell? It just crashed into everything. We we're doing moderately fine. All right, all right, all right. Come on, get in the power band. All right, use the rail, tap the rail, there we go. 
If we're gonna drive in a destructive manner, we might as well get the best out of it. Right, red line. Up. Up. Ow. Ow. That's the thing, downshifting. Upshifting, I've got sort of sorted out. No, don't crash. Don't re No, lag. This is lagging a bit. Ooh, that was... I didn't know I could do that. Okay. That is interesting. I think we're gonna do... We're gonna do the whole rally here. And we're gonna see how my mind deteriorates. And you're probably... Ooh, stage complete. Okay. I thought that was... Alright, 4.15. And the time... We were 34 seconds behind. So, yeah. We're down to ninth. Alright, Finland. Let's... Let's just take a deep breath. Alright. What needs to be reversed? Suspension as well. Bodywork and weight. Cooling system can wait. Uh... Alright, what can wait from here? Wheels. No. I guess the suspension can wait. Alright, the gearbox and the engine. Alright, what else can wait? The brakes can wait, yeah. Alright, one minute remaining. Alright, car setup. Alright, what's the info? Alright, info. Medium gravel, 40%. Alright, so gravel tires. Rough gravel tires, alright. Let's race. I did not have time to repair the bodywork. On a medium bread. So yeah. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, don't crash, don't crash, don't crash. Come on, go. Up. This game's really hard with the keyboard. Alright. Crash. Come on. Come on. Power out of it. Ow, lag spike. Seriously, I think it's a thermal throttle. I think I need a fan. But it would compromise the audio quality. I, I need I, I have a fan that blow that can be used to blow air into this. Well not into but at this. But it's kinda noisy as most fans tend to be, so I don't use it as much as I would. But then again, if I can like I cannot isolate it. I I wish I had like my monitor and microphone and keyboard in another in a separate recording room but I don't like ideally in a recording studio situation like if I had a recording studio for gaming which I do not have I would have all my audio sensitive sensitive components in one side so I'd have the tower PC on what on outside the recording room and I have the monitor and I'd have a pair of noise cancelling closed back studio monitors for the sound. I'd like some uh, Audio Technica ATH M50s, those for monitoring the sound. And then I'd have the interior of the gaming recording room padded with foam and stuff so it, there would be no sound. Uh, leaking from the outside there would be no all right all right so that what that would accomplish is all right let's drop it in first gear all right and just do this via handbrake turns when i'm under steering all right i'm getting moderately better at that all right and into a tree all right Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, this has not gone well. This stage has not gone well. 
hopefully we will finish uh, somewhere near the top, but I don't think so. My concentration has been dropping really uh, rapidly, and even my my somehow bombastic personality is now well muted slightly. Right, I see the longer gears were a mistake because I tend or a mistake in terms of how I drive, not the car itself. The tires were right, mostly. I could have gone for softer tires, maybe. Keep in mind that I will be uploading, uploading with the noise, but the noise will be... Ow. Ow. That's the thing, I forget to downshift. Like, I think the downshift will be automatic. Maybe I should use semi-automatic, but then it would just be. Like, that would be really cheating. I, I'd rather lose because I'm driving manual than win because I'm driving automatic. It's just... And that's... I'm not gonna say that's how I am, but that's what I believe in. And that's stupid, it's kinda stupid, but it also makes some sense. 30 seconds behind. Yeah, that was bad. Alright, continue in Sweden. Alright, car repair. Alright, the exhaust needs some repairs. Engine, gearbox, cooling. Alright, axles, wheels. Yeah, the rest will have to wait. Car setup. Um. Alright, info. This is snow stage, so... Ah, uh, it's snow, heavy snow. Snow tires. Alright, this one's gonna go with mid gears, like not as short. Alright. Let's race. And let's in some bread. I love this stage, I love the snow stage. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Four, three, two... One, go. Alright, I need less grip. If I'm gonna drive the way I drive, I need less grip. Really bumpy though. Even though the suspension is as soft as it can be, this stage is super bumpy. There's no jumps in it though. Well, no, not a lot. Not fast jumps there's one right here but and there's a really cool downhill section and the lag you see that you see how it jumps frame rate just drops and I don't know why I, I think it's a thermal throttling because not just this it's not just the CPU it's the GPU that thermal throttles as well maybe I should remove the cover plate and have ooh, the crowd is cheering yeah, that is encouraging, even though I almost run them over. I think I should study the stages more, like I should scout them before playing, but then again... I don't know. Maybe I should devote more time into the game itself rather than the gaming experience, because... I don't know, maybe I should make like a, a driving montage of every stage and uh, and just do them without commentary but then the commentary is what makes the gaming experience and the gameplay and the let's play that's what makes it if you do not comment on a game it's just a walkthrough or you're just showing off and I know I'm punishing the poor engine but it can take it I love this stage it's just so beautiful even though it's rendered in low quality 3D graphic, it's still beautiful. Rain, rain and snow, and the cold rain and snow. Well, she went up to her room and she sang her playful tune. Leave me out in the cold rain and snow. Rain and snow. Leave me out in the cold rain and snow. Oh, that song is beautiful, man. That song is called Rain and Snow by the Grateful Dead. 
I think what makes snow so special is that you got so little grip that you can really play with the car. And that gives that freedom gives you speed, a lot of speed. Look. I mean that's not the ideal line, but it's faster than I, what I would have done on tarmac. And softening the suspension really works well for snow. Not not for tarmac or even gravel or dirt, but it works well for snow. Because snow is humid whereas other surfaces are dry. So snow retains the slipperiness in all directions, whilst gravel it's not as slippery in some directions as it is in others. So the beautiful thing about snow is that, or ice for that matter, icy gravel I think as well, is that the grip or the lack of grip is distributed equally and I went into the snowbank, which I shouldn't do because that catches your tires and it slows you down. It doesn't make you crash, it actually prevents you from crashing, but it slows you down a lot. You have to... Uh, ooh, stage complete. Alright, let's see how we did. 346. Whoa. That was... The winning time. Which is... I'm quite happy. Told you we'd do well on this one. So we're fifth overall. So we just need to... Get like second places in the rest and we get a podium finish. All right. And our two stages, if I can. All right, Germany again. Okay. All right, car repair. Wheels. Body work. Wait, body work's not necessary. All right, suspension. Brakes are necessary. Oh, I could repair all of them. Okay. Information. Osterwald. Smooth tarmac, one tarmac, light gravel. All right. All right. Car repair. We've done that. Car setup. Wet tarmac, smooth tarmac. All right. Let's go with smooth tarmac tires. And the stuck. All right. Let's go with it. Let's race. You know what? Let's race. I'm pumped. Let's race. Ready for it. All right, let's go. Let's just go. I'm trying a new method of recording. I'm recording the audio separately and just capturing the in-game audio with uh, Fraps or, well, my OpenGL capture program. That upshift was too early. All right. Dude, the road is so unclear here, like, I don't see it. Alright, let's avoid that tree. Alright, we cheated, but we avoided a crash. I guess we could call that a win. Alright, let's, let's tarmac here. Let's take advantage of that. And sharp left. That was fortunate. Not the best move, that, but it wasn't so bad. All right, crowd is cheering. Let's go. I forgot to downshift. Damn, I always forget to downshift in the corners. I wonder why. Oh, oh, the handbrake does work. Oh, since I'm using tarmac tires. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Oh, here. I was like, where am I supposed to go now? Whoa. Oh, fuck. 